We live together with other human beings, not just at Sunrise Ranch, but all over the world. We live with other human beings in families, in communities, in networks of people, in organizations, and so on, in nations. And so we have a great cultural experience to experiment with. We get to come together with other people who are doing the individual experiment and experiment together about how we create a culture that is radically different from the culture that we're living in. I think to the average person, the world looks like there are slots you can fit into. And if you fit into a slot and you find the right slot, you can get it ticking over on your nine to five and then, I don't know, do the family thing, plug into that and lead some kind of mundane life. But a life of great creativity is one where a person is unrestrained. And the normal restraints that other people see somehow don't apply to them or don't stop them. They know what really matters is the creativity that is coming through them. And it somehow fits within the strictures of the world around them or somehow flows around those strictures or goes a different direction, kind of like water going downhill. It just finds its path, but it's going to go downhill. And in the same way, when a person's truly being creative, they're doing it in their garage, they're doing it you know, in their office, they are making it up as they go along, they are enrolling other people, they are just hugely creative in an entrepreneurial way in whatever field they are in. The field of unrestrained creativity that is open to us is in this field of the expression consciously of the creator being that we are in our life experience. So what I say is that for you and for me, we have an opportunity for unrestrained creativity in terms of our own conscious experience. So our own experience in heart and mind and what we allow to pour through. And whatever else is happening in our human experience, coming back to some means by which we individually allow an outpouring of creativity is job one. However it happens, wherever it goes, however much money you're making from it or not, what really matters in the end more than anything is the outpouring of your creativity in consciousness so that you're having new awarenesses, new ideas, new feelings, new ways of relating to other people. When we're involved in this great experiment, at some point along the way, we reflect, we can reflect on our own experience and become aware of something like this. I am different. I have changed. And I am changing. I am not who I was. There is something more of who I am that has come forth into awareness that is now operative as me. That's what I, I want to be about with anybody else who wants to be about it. And there's the delight, the enjoyment of going into that new land with, with whoever wants to go there. <laughs>